What's up, guys? Welcome back once again. It is me, Molt, here early this morning uh, recording this, and I'm tired. So if I sound a little congested or whatnot, it's because I'm a little bit tired, but we are doing Boom Beach today. I haven't done this in about six days. I have been playing. I tried to record uh, the other day, but I've really been working on uh, my Road to Masters series and whatnot. So uh, yeah, but we are back, and I've upgraded a lot of stuff. So um, let's see if I can actually... Uh, so I've upgraded this this landing craft is level seven and then all these other ones are level six in the last video Oh, and this one's level seven um, How many of them can I do? Eh, never mind um, So I've been upgrading those my mortar this one right here is max now So that is level seven I need and this one is level seven So both of my mortars are maxed out now for my headquarter level eight um, my Sniper towers can all go up to level 9, I believe, and all of them are at level 8 as well. Uh, can this gun go up? Yeah, so my cannon can go up. Uh, both of those are level 3. And I've done a little bit more upgrading. I upgraded my radar, and um, I've done a lot of researching. As you can see, I already researched my um, artillery shell and my warriors and now I am upgrading my uh, my heavies and they're gonna be done in two hours so that's gonna be sweet and then probably what I'll upgrade next after them is um, maybe the heal spell uh, the heal spell the uh, the med kit maybe I'll do that so yeah that'll probably be done this afternoon sometime once I Get all my gold up and once these heavies are done but why don't we go ahead and go out here resource base defended sweet Let's view this battle and see how well my resource base did. Um, I laid it out specifically like this. I think that it looked... Why wouldn't they do that? Did they take it out? Wow. So they took that out. Um, they took out that big artillery gun and still weren't able to uh, take it all out. This is a big army. I'm surprised that they weren't able to, to take everything out. But this cannon right here in the middle just does so much work. It's ridiculous. Um, but I laid everything out in a fan position because this way if the guy wants to use his artillery shells like he did Then he's not gonna be able to use his um, his flares to bring everybody in so Right now you can see we're taking out a whole lot of a whole lot of people um, the snipers are doing work as well uh, Just taking everybody out one shot at a time And why don't we go ahead and replay the speed up a little bit more? Um I'm so happy that the bazooka girls have such little health because it's really easy for them to just get um, taken out. So the heavies are down now. Uh, we can fast forward a little bit more again. And there we go. So the layout of that worked really well. If you guys get a... Uh, what level is it? Wait, is that not the one that I just had? What happened? Oh no, so I lost it right here. After that battle, I guess. Um, let's view this loss and let's see if maybe I can get it back. I don't know if I'll be able to. Um, so he's taken out that as well. That's almost, that's the same army composition as that last person. Um, it could have been the same person as well. Uh, so they do the same thing pretty much. I'm not going to watch that. But that was Chong Daddy. And then, yeah, so Chong Daddy attacked it twice. First time he lost, second time he won. Um... I don't. If he could barely take it out with his army composition, I'm definitely not going to be able to with uh, how little troops I have and whatnot. So um, we're going to go around and let's see what this looks like. We're going to go around and see if we can get a couple of attacks in. Ugh, I do not want to mess with that. I hate those cannons. Um, we'll stick to the lower level ones right now. <laughs> oh, gosh. Um, this one has a whole bunch of cannons on it, too. Which I hate. I hate that these just one-shot people. Um, let's see. We'll want to get rid of one entire side of it. Let's see if we can find. So that's down to the wire. We might come back to that one. Or we'll definitely come back to it. Um, what is this one? This one's new. Yeah, we can take this one out probably. I definitely think we can take this one out. So let's go ahead and attack this. And we need to be very, very precise with our artillery shells. I want to drop them right in between the headquarters and the mortar. There we go. And then on this side as well. There we go. And then now we are just going to head straight for these really low level um, sniper towers right here. Um, 
I'm not going to use any spells or anything or uh, whatever just to make sure that I have as many of these points as possible to use. I'm just going to work our way around. Please, no, not the flare gun. All right, come over here. Nope, over there. Heal them up again and then send them back here. Nope, get away from it. <laughs> there we go. All right, so they are all out of range of the flamethrower now. And there's a victory. I think we lost a couple of them, maybe three or so. Um, but that's not bad. Uh, how many? Two. All right, yeah, so two's not bad at all. Um, I really like these warriors. I kind of want to do a uh, an all warrior an all warrior uh, series on here. Not necessarily a series, but just do a video where I do all warrior attacks. Um, let's go ahead and check this one out and see if we can take this out with what we have left. Uh, I feel like we might be able to. Let's attack this one too. Because honestly, those artillery things don't do too much damage. Um, we're going to take out this mortar right here. Yeah, and then we are going to just head straight over to all of those uh, little barrels. And then we're going to do this. Take all of those out as they just come over and wreck through this. And let's bring them right here to this middle one. Do that again. Come on, guys. Take them out. There we go. And they all should be out of range. Those heavies might not be, but I'm pretty sure they are. Yeah, so the heavies weren't out of range, but it's fine. Now they are. Um, and then we will bring them all back here. Out of range of those machine guns. And then we can go ahead and just use our artillery on this as well. And take that one out. It's really important just to figure out which side of the base you want to attack. Um, those big guns over on the left, sweet, no casualties, those big guns over on the left do um, an okay amount of damage, it's just very consistent. So if you can get to them and get within range of them, um, then you're going to be doing just fine. Looks like we're going to be able to upgrade something in this video as well, guys, so that's good. Let's go scout, see what this one looks like. Um, I think I've attacked this one before. I almost want to go just around the back of it so that I don't have to deal with that flamethrower in the front. Um, yeah, that might be what I do. So we're going to go ahead and attack this one, and I'm just going to use, um, I don't even, I haven't <laughs> learned all the names of these, uh, spells or anything yet, but we're going to come back this way. Where are you guys going? Thank you. I don't know why it just took them so long to turn over there. And let's go ahead and drop this down as well. And let's bring them all the way back up here. There we go. Heal them up. We'll take that thing out. Yep, yeah, take that out. Take out that sniper tower. Come on. Now head over here. Heal them up. Oh, I dropped that heal spell in a horrible place. I don't know if we'll be able to get this one. Freaking flamethrower. Come on, take it out. We're so close. We're so close. Come on. Come on. Come on. Yes. All right, so that's good. Um, whenever the defenses are really close together like that, it's super, um, not super hard, but a lot more challenging to get a victory on there. You have to be a lot more uh, focused on how you're using your spells. I probably could have done that a little bit better, but it's whatever. Um, I'm going to change troops and I'm going to do um, all warriors now on this. So let's just do all warriors. Um, all warriors. And we'll see how this goes. It should be pretty interesting. And then I think what I want to upgrade um, now is I don't want to do the machine gun. That one's level 7. This one's level 6. So those are getting up. The cannon. Uh, is a good one that I can do because those piss people off. I know that they do. <laughs> this one's level three. This one's level three. Um, we'll go ahead and do this one right here. So we'll upgrade that cannon. And then um, later on today, I'm going to have to get 60,000, 63,000 more gold in order to upgrade the heavy. But that's going to be it. So, guys, thank you so much for watching um this video i hope that you all enjoyed um we're gonna try and get things a little bit more specific from here on out make some series you guys can let me know what you want maybe uh 
I don't know. You could always do a road to a certain number of medals or trophies. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, so yeah, comment down below for those of you who play Boom Beach what you might want to see. Uh, I appreciate y'all watching. I really do mean that. And as always, guys, keep calm and boom on, okay? I'll see you later.